Hello, my name is Mr. Renzi. I'm the math specialist here at Wedgwood Elementary School. A little bit about myself. I have a Bachelor of Arts in Elementary Education, a Bachelor of Arts in Mathematics, and a Master's Degree in School Administration and Supervision. Throughout my 25-year career in the Washington Township Public Schools, I've taught fifth grade for 11 years. I was also an elementary supervisor, an elementary principal, and for the past nine years here at Wedgwood School, I've been one of our BSI math teachers. Throughout the years, I've been the recipient of numerous awards, being named Bell School Teacher of the Year and Wedgwood School Teacher of the Year. In 2018, I was also named the Gloucester County Teacher of the Year. My hobby is Lego. I love building Lego and taking Lego photography. And believe it or not, Lego and math have many things in common. So what exactly is basic skills math and how do your students qualify for the program? When we assess students to qualify for basic skills math, we're looking at fact fluency, number sense, teacher recommendation, the ability to work independently, their performance in class, the STAR math assessment, and any state testing that may be given in specific grade levels. This year, our basic skills math ser services will be held a little bit different. In the past, they always take place right in the classroom. However, now that we are in a hybrid model, our basic skills math services will be delivered via WebEx meetings. The meeting times for each of the grade levels is listed on the screen, as are the cohorts on each of the days. All meeting links have been provided to both the parents and or students. What do we do in our basic skills math, math league meetings? Well, we kind of review math. My job is to give them that extra help that they may need, teach them some skills that they haven't yet grasped. Maybe it's working on counting or it's working on the basic facts. Uh, anything in mathematics that your child may need, we will go ahead and focus on those weaknesses. In the different grade levels, math skills come to the forefront. In grade one, students work often with number lines and place value, the ones and the tens, addition and subtraction and number stories and measurement, and telling time to the hour and the half hour, shapes and their attributes and equal parts, halves and fourths, which starts to introduce fractions. Also, our first, first graders will have the opportunity to participate in some math clubs. Our math clubs are for those students who have demonstrated knowledge of such areas as the Friends of Ten or the Doubles Club. Membership to our math clubs allows the student to receive a certificate and a math pencil, congratulating them for a job well done. Our grade two students will learn about money and coins, and this time uh, in place value, we'll take them out to the hundreds place. They'll work on addition and subtraction strategies and measurement shapes and telling time to the five minutes and equal parts will involve halves, thirds, and fourths. For grade three, our students will work on addition and subtraction of bigger numbers, and then they will begin multiplication and division strategies. Measurement, telling time to the minute, elapsed time, quadrilaterals, fractions, and equivalent fractions all become a big focus to the third grade mathematician. As the students move into fourth grade, place value becomes larger as students practice numbers to the millions. They continue to work on addition and subtraction of bigger numbers, and multiplication and division of bigger numbers comes to the forefront. Students will also work on unit conversions, geometry, adding and subtraction fractions with like denominators, equivalent fractions, and they get introduced to decimals all the way out to the hundredths place. Our fifth graders involve place value that uses exponents. 
as they continue to learn their multiplication and division of bigger numbers. Line plots are continued, geometry, decimals to the thousands, and then a lot of fractions and decimals, adding, subtracting, multiplying, and dividing both of them. Our students in grades three through five also have a math club. That math club is the Fearsome 15, the 15 most difficult multiplication problems that there are. Students, again, can try out for a math club by demonstrating knowledge of the Fearsome 15. Successful students will earn a certificate and a math pencil. The Everyday Math Program, which is what we use here in Washington Township Public Schools, comes with the Connect Ed online math component found within ClassLink. The Connect Ed McGraw-Hill Education app contains the math lessons that students will learn, journal activities for students to practice, home links, which is a fancy name for homework, the e-toolkit, which contains all the virtual manipulatives that they can use on the computer to help them solve math problems, and the ever-popular ConnectEd games. In Washington Township, we also use First in Math. First in Math is an online math supplement also found within ClassLink. First in Math is online gaming to practice math skills. It creates a high level of engagement has deep practice. It provides the M in STEM, which stands for science, technology, engineering, and math. One of the good things about First in Math is that there's student choice. Students can choose what they want to practice on, where they want to get, what they want to solve. Students also compete for player of the day in First in Math. In their classrooms, the student that earns the most stickers the prior school day is declared the player of the day and gets the digital player of the day badge emailed to him or her. First in Math participants also compete for the team of the week. The team of the week is made up of all of the students in a classroom. Students that earn 10,000 or more stickers in First in Math during the school year become a grand champion and they are inducted into the Wedgwood School First in Math, Wall of Fame. Both Connect Ed and a First in Math can be found within your child's ClassLink account. The First in Math icon has the little bronze medal and is labeled First in Math, and the Connect Ed app is located within McGraw Hill Education. If you ever need to get in touch with me, please email me at drenzi at wtps.org. And if you have a Twitter account, I encourage you to follow me at at mustang underscore math. Have a great day. I look forward to working with your child this school year as we make math fun and engaging for all.